This is a patient whose pain doctor referred her for a cervical ultrasound guided injection. She had an injection in the past which gave her a lot of relief of her chronic headache as well as neck and arm pain. She had ultrasound guided brachial plexus blocks, auricular temporal and occipital nerve blocks as well as cervical facet capsule medial branch injections of local anesthetic with dexamethasone. Today I'm going to repeat some of the injections she had previously as she's markedly improved since her previous injection and she still continues to have some headaches some days. She's going to receive a an auricular temporal nerve block, an occipital nerve block, as well as paravertebral cervical blocks, which include the medial branch as well as the capsule of the facet joint. And she's also going to get trigger point injections of the neck. So I'm going to look for the auricular temporal nerve. This one we did a while ago. Color mode. I'm looking for her auricular temporal nerve. It runs near the temporal artery. Okay, here's the temporal artery, and sometimes you can see the nerve passing over the artery. Okay, I'm just going to infiltrate in that plane because it's a little hard to see that. Okay, a little pinch on, okay. Pinch. Okay. So, we prep her neck, go back to her neck. We're gonna do the cervical paravertebral nerve blocks. And she responded at the levels of C3, 4, 5 in the past. So scan downwards. Here's the highest transverse process would be C2. And going down would be C3 articular pillar. Right there, a little pinch. And trigger points on the way in. Needle mode. Right there, my needle's on the articular pillar. And by the joint capsule as well as some probably going anterior into the foramen. I'm gonna move down, another pinch. One level down, another pinch. Okay. Mm -hmm. How are we feeling? Good. 